we just finished creating the construction lines for the objects you have on your paper in front of you now we're gonna put in the object lines by switching this to our object line layer click on line and we're gonna use something we have not used before so far we've only used the object snap toolbar to click to endpoints and midpoints and things of that nature there's also this running object snap toolbar which means that you can set all kinds of things that will always click to make sure that you have extension intersection center endpoint and tangent selected those are ones you will need for this tutorial I like to have all the ones you see here selected at all times because those are the ones I find most useful feel free to change it up however you want click OK uh, we're gonna turn that on we're gonna go to line and I wanna draw out object lines that go around our construction lines repeat this for the top the front and the side view now we're gonna go back in we're gonna turn off our construction layer because we have the top front and side view we know this is what we want it to look like uh, we're gonna add a couple more things to make this look more like what you have on your paper we're gonna go into offset again and we know how to use offset I want the offset to be one inch so I type in one and click enter I'm gonna focus just on the front view click on the horizontal line and the leftmost vertical line and we're going to use the trim function. The easiest way to use trim is you select it. You right click so it will select anything and everything you click. And then you just click on what parts you want to get rid of. And we'll stop with that and start another tutorial in just a second.